For centuries, man-made rivers have carried goods and people to market. Today, many canals are more for pleasure than commerce, but you can still get a taste of the past in Canal Fulton, Ohio. Here, people travel as they did two centuries ago, at a leisurely pace, with more time to discover where they are and where they've been. Uh, the boat's powered by two Percheron draft horses named Sam and Shorty. Uh, they're 11, 9 and 11 years old, I believe. I'm steering the boat um, with a wooden rudder. It's connected in the back and takes a lot of power to let this get this boat turned around. It takes a lot of power to steer it. Uh, the horses are connected to the boat with an uh, inch and a quarter rope and um, they pull it every day of the week. Uh, the canal's over 150 years old, so you'll get to see a living piece of history right here. Uh, there's um, a lot of ducks. You'll see a lot of fish swimming, uh, jumping out of the water, turtles, and there's a lot of trees along the way that if you're interested in nature, it's a place to come. Back 200 years ago, canals played a crucial role in the day-to-day -day life of the people. Watching the people have a good time on the boat, uh, taking them for a nice relaxing trip and just even me getting out here and being relaxed it's a nice trip it's quiet uh, no distractions really of the modern type besides the bicyclists going by and occasional cars you can hear it's pretty relaxing it almost takes you back into the 1800s the canal was originally dug to give cheaper transportation for farmers goods um, back in the 1800s, it cost uh, 10 cents to carry a barrel of wheat by wagon, and by canal it only cost a penny. So you can see there's quite a difference in what the canal did for the economy of Ohio, and that's what it was for. It was to ship uh, coal, lumber, grain, hay, and even iron ore to the steel factories in uh, Pittsburgh. They'd take it down to the Ohio River and then ship it up by stern wheel up to the Pittsburgh. Today, many of these canals have been filled in and in other places built over. Towpaths have been paved over for bicycles. It's good to see some of them preserved to give us a glimpse of our past. 